Hi there. Welcome to our one night sneak peek. My name is Angie, Angie Hunt or Angie in Progress if you follow me on Facebook um, or Instagram or, or Pinterest or any place else. I am going to be posting over the next few hours and I'm going to try to keep, you know, any of these videos short because I know that we're all busy and, you know, this is not meant to take up hours and hours of your time. So I'm gonna to try to go through everything fairly quickly. At any point, if you have any questions or wanna ask me anything, just post it in the comments below the video and I'll get on it right away. I'll be checking throughout the night to you know, keep answering your questions. Um, I'll also be just sharing some information. Not everything will be a video. I'll be sharing some videos from other coaches, people on my team, people I know, um, who you know have also explained some of the different aspects of coaching as well. So just to tell you, the first video here is just for me to tell you a little bit about myself. So I am, um, right now, I'm a busy mom. I have four kids. Uh, I married my high school sweetheart. We've been married over 20 years, which I can't believe, oh my goodness. Um, before I started coaching, I used to be a first grade teacher before I had my kids, and I loved teaching. It was my favorite thing, um, and I always thought I would go back to teaching, and until very recently, about three years ago when I fell into coaching, I was just about to put my resume together and uh, look into getting back into teaching. Um, I was kind of at that point where I wanted to start contributing to the family, um, and you know, just having something of my own. I loved teaching, so it, it was on my mind to go back to teaching. But uh, then this whole coaching thing kind of came up, and how that came up was um, I have always been pretty active, and I used to run, I've run uh, six marathons and done some different you know, types of races like that. And my good friend Janelle, who um, Janelle Summers, her sister is Shalene Johnson, um, so you may have seen her in some of Shalene's workout videos, uh, Pio, Shalene Extreme, Turbo Fire, Turbo Jam. Um, so my good friend Janelle uh, is in most of those videos with her sister Shalene. I grew up with the two of them in a small town in Michigan before they moved to um, Grand Rapids, Michigan. So anyways, she and I had kept in touch and she knew I was fairly active and, you know, running. And then she also knew that I had started doing P90X between a couple of, um, between having a couple of my kids and I was getting really good results with it. So she asked me, she had recently started coaching. She asked me if I had considered becoming a coach because I was already doing the workout program and I was getting good results and people were asking me about it and I was talking about it. I was a totally an unofficial spokesperson for it, uh, but I didn't understand what coaching was. I didn't really take the time to figure it out. I had these small kids and um, I just, I just kind of didn't pay much attention, but I was following her on Facebook so I could kind of see what she was doing and she was posting a lot about fitness and posting a lot about, you know, health and exercise and things like that that I was interested in. So, you know, I just was kind of keeping my eye on her and I had mentioned it to a few friends of mine and they warned me that it was a pyramid scheme. So, I had no idea what a pyramid scheme was, but I kind of wrote it off because I thought, well, I don't think that I should do something if it's a pyramid scheme. So, um I, again, I just kind of didn't consider it. I didn't think about it again until about four or five years later when I started struggling with my own health and fitness and I was kind of steadily gaining weight, even though I felt like I was doing the same things that, you know, I was exercising, I was eating what I thought was pretty healthy food. And I had been watching Janelle post about Shakeology and I really wanted to try it. And I knew I needed a new fitness program because I had gotten good results with P90X when I did it a few years prior. And, you know, all the running I was doing and it just, it, it clearly wasn't working because I was just stuck. And not only was I stuck, but I was gaining and I was frustrated. So uh, I reached out to Janelle and told her, okay, I think I want to try Shakeology, but I, it's, I feel like it's kind of expensive. So um, maybe I'll sign up as a coach just so I can get the, the discount, the 25% discount, which is how I started. So for those of you who are considering signing up as a coach strictly for the discount, that is exactly why I joined. I joined for the discount. I wanted 25% off on my Shakeology and a new fitness program. And I, you know, my husband and I were both fans already, so I knew that we would take advantage of that 25% discount. And then I thought, well, maybe, you know, maybe um, a couple of my friends or family members at some point might want to order something through me and I'll make a little commission and that'll be nice. But what happened was, so I signed up as a coach, I started drinking Shakeology, and even though my husband was super skeptical about the business and 
about Shakeology and things like that. He was supportive and, um, you know, we just knew since there was no risk, I had researched it well enough to know that that if we found out that it was a scam, even though I, in the end, I felt like, okay, Janelle wouldn't invite me to do something that was a scam or a pyramid scheme or anything like that. So I'm just going to trust her and do it. Uh, but we knew if there was some reason that we weren't, you know, th that it wasn't what we thought it would be, then I could just quit at any time. So th there was no risk and that was a big part of it. Um, so I started doing my new workout program. I started drinking Shakeology and totally fell in love with every aspect of it. And so then I thought, well, maybe I can do, you know, learn a little bit about this business and maybe run a challenge group and um, start earning some income that will pay for, at least pay for my Shakeology. Um, so I started getting results right away and people were noticing. And so I invited some of my friends to do a challenge group with me on Facebook. We just basically had a group of us that were all kind of working out and getting results together. And it was so much fun. Uh, they invited some of their friends and then I invited some family members to my next group. And then I started running more groups and more groups. And then what started happening was everybody was getting results, everybody was feeling really good, and um, my business just kind of started growing, sort of accidentally. Um, I saw that there was a real income opportunity with this. Not only was I making like some commissions, but I was also starting to build a team because friends of mine were also enjoying drinking Shakeology and liking their programs and talking about it with their friends, and so they joined as a coach. And so I started building this team and then I noticed that the, the bigger my team got, the, the more income potential that there was. So what started out as just a way for me to get started on my own fitness journey ended up turning into, I don't think I need to go back to teaching now because I'm making some significant income. Um, so it was also something that I was enjoying doing so much that it didn't feel like a job at all. It just kind of felt like a hobby. So I was messing around with it. You know, I'd talk to people on my phone and, you know, uh, my computer, my laptop. Um, it was very portable and, you know, I'm just always able to to work from home and be there for my kids. And I put in at the beginning, probably about an hour or two a day. Um, and then now that I do this more as a full-time gig, I guess, um, then, you know, some days I spend three hours. Sometimes if I've got the time for it, just, you know, while the kids are at school, I'm usually plugging in and helping my team and talking to my challenge groups. And it's all just, it's been, I, it just a ton of fun. Um, so like I said, I started with running groups with my friends and family members um, and then kind of started building a team. And as a result, I have this amazing team of people that I work with. We seriously have so much fun. We, um, you know, run ideas past each other. We come up with, you know, different plans and we keep each other on track every single day. Um, we do a lot of groups together and things and I have learned a lot from them. Uh, we just share a lot of information and I feel as a result of this entire process, um, I've got this whole new family of positive, positive people who keep me working on myself and um, I've, I'm fitter than I ever have been, like even since my 20s. <laughs> um, I feel better than ever. I feel more confident. Um, I used to hide from pictures and cameras and things like that. And I promised Janelle, if I signed up as a coach, I would never take a picture of myself. Um, and now if you follow me on Facebook, you see that I take pictures of myself all the time. <laughs> but it's been an experience for me to learn how to feel more comfortable in my own skin and how to become just a better, I'm a better mom, I'm a better wife, I'm, I feel better. When you feel better, you are better. So it's just been a huge positive influence on my life. And I just never would have seen this coming at all. My only regret about coaching is that I didn't sign up right away when Janelle first asked me like four or five years ago. Um, but, you know, all things happen, you know, in the time that maybe they were meant to. And so this was my time to find something for me. And like I said, I no longer have to go um, back to school, even though it's something I love doing. I love coaching even more don't tell. But um, I love doing this. And I really love sharing the information with uh, new people, new perspective coaches and um, answering your questions and things like that. And I'll share a, a screenshot of my income from, 
you know, previous years around this time up to now so that you can kind of get an idea of how that growth happens. It's definitely not a get rich quick scheme, but what most coaches find is that they love doing it so much that it just becomes a passion and it's helping other people first. And then the income just kind of starts to be a byproduct of that. So um, I'll share a little bit about the do's and don't like what I do and what I don't do and in the next post, I'll talk about, you know, some of the, the misconceptions that people have about coaching um, so that you can kind of get a rough idea of, you know, if you have fears and reservations, you are not alone. Everybody has had them, including me. Um, and so go ahead and post any questions you have about anything I've just said or anything you'd like to see me answer in the next couple of posts, and I'll be sure to do that. So that's it for video number one, just a little about me. And I'll share my favorite little screenshot of um, a pyramid scheme um, underneath in the comments, which I think you'll find is very familiar to most every corporate structure business model <laughs> that there is. Um, so rest assured, this is not a pyramid scheme. Pyramid schemes are actually illegal. And they were, they have been for many, many years. So that's not what this is. This is just a legitimate opportunity to turn just sort of an, a non-traditional job into something that has huge six and seven figure potential. So that's it for, for this one and lots more to come.